My name is Lisa Wranglin and I serve as president for the Rhode Island Black Business Association. And we're really excited to be here because we're celebrating our grand opening. We actually opened our first office. We've been around for the last four years and we're excited because we opened our, four, um, our first office. In addition, we actually launched a partnership with Freedom National Bank here in Greenville to actually do small business lending. Also, the City of Providence just awarded the organization $200,000 for collateral support as well as technical assistance for businesses within Providence. So we are just really, really excited about this. And of course, we're having a networking event right now, celebrating with our members, community leaders, and local elected officials. For Chapecito Media, what is your perspective of the opening of RIVA for the state of Rhode Island? Well, I think anything that promotes and helps small businesses and, bus and, and in increases the business uh, friendliness in the state of Rhode Island is good, and, and, and RIVA is, is an example of that. Organizing businesses uh, that uh, want to uh, you know, be uh, successful and then providing them with the re help and resources to do that. There's not, a, there's not enough of that outreach in our, in our state right now with the small businesses, so something like this is just another example that Rhode Island can kind of make Rhode Island a place that uh, uh, is business friendliness is friendly and that organizations like this will help to do that.